Hey guys, got the mask for you. Your nearest army surplus. This will protect you from, uh, I don't know, anything. But could you picture yourself wearing this? Going grocery shopping with this. Going out on a date with this. <laughs> I don't think so. So, follow my channel and watch me make a mask that you could walk around with and it will protect you. Might not, but that's the chance you gotta take. Or go to your army surplus and buy one of these. It's only a hundred and something dollars each. Hey guys, I'm back. This is R Matthew's channel. And this mess could protect you from anything. But look at it. I want to be caught dead walking down the street with this thing on. So, I want to show you guys how to make a better mask. Stay tuned. Hello guys, this is R. Matthews channel on YouTube. And today, I want to talk to you about face masks for the coronavirus. I went to Home Depot. Ace Hardware, some local hardware store, paint shops, automotive paint shops, all the masks are out. They're all sold out. I mean, they went off the shelf so fast that you can't even get your hands on it. But not to worry, you're like me, I got a solution. I went to Home Depot, picked up this. Honeywell FPR graded 10 that's the top of the line this thing will keep dust lint airborne dust dust mite debris pollen pet dandruff mole spore that's a good one right there because the mole spore is so tiny Bacteria, microscopic allergen. That's what we need. Somebody coughs in your face. Well, not coughing in your face, but coughing in your path. You're at a supermarket. CDC says, don't wear a mask. Are you going to take that chance? And walk right through where somebody just sneezes or cough? Life is about choices. You make it. I'd rather have a mask. So I want to teach you guys how to make one. Buying this right here. Because they still have this on the market. This is a filter for air conditioning and heating. HVAC. And I'll take it apart and show you guys how to make yourself a mask. And works or not, I don't know. But like I say, you have a choice. You ever walk into something where somebody's coughing or something and don't have it or have an extra safety it's like a they say it's like a spare tire do you need a spare tire all the time no but just that one time you need, you need it and plus i'm going to be traveling soon and we get in that plane it's a capsule you're breathing everybody's junk so i'm going to make one so when I get on that plane, I don't care what people say. Look at me different. Somebody's coughing. Somebody's yakking or whatever they're doing. <laughs> I'm going to be protected. Yes, you got to wash your hands. Don't touch your face, your eyes, or your nose. I mean, that's simple. That's what they say to do. CDC says wash your hands. 
don't touch your eyes, don't touch your nose, and don't touch your mouth. Okay, that's great. But you still need a mask. So let's make one. Let me show you how. Okay, here's my setup. Got my filter. This is what I cut out right here. This will make like maybe 15 masks. Masks. Don't worry about the metal wiring um, netting right there. Be okay. So all you need is scissors. Okay. I'm going to show you how to take this off. After you cut this out, don't worry about the extra stuff that's stuck onto the paper here. Just cut it. Just cut it down. The cardboard. And then cut it across. And the trick is, on these right here, you want to pinch pinch the bottom of the the filter while you pull up the cardboard because they have it lightly glue if you just if you don't pinch it and then you pull it off it'll tear and that wouldn't be good because then you compromise the um, the filter itself alrighty let's start Alrighty, so let's put this to the side. Got the filter itself. Just flatten it. Cut it. I don't know. Part of your palm side and you will want to cut it right on the the cross right there but don't go on the just cut right on the cross where they meet Okay, got one mass right there. Okay, trim it off a little bit, make it look decent. Okay, pretend this is your, the center part will be your nose right there, that area. Your mouth will be right here. So where your nose is at, fold this, fold the filter in half, and cut it as if it's in an angle, and then open it. Okay, see, this part will be for your nose, will sit on your nose. And that's it on one okay I also bought some vent filters and it does um, pick up dust dirt smoke and um, pollen so we'll take one little strip off of it We're gonna paste it right in front of it. Okay. 
Okay. Okay, look at this, see? Airflow in. That means this size, the side that's on the outside, the metal will be on your face side. So this is going to be the outside. This is going to be next to your face. So this is the padding, so you won't feel the metal. You won't feel the metal um, netting on your face, and then you just trim. Okay. Remember, this is face. This is going to be touching towards your face. The extra filter for um, cushion, so you won't feel the metal, the metal wiring mesh. Let me trim this a little better. Okay. There you go. Next, any colored, any colored duct tape. And then I'll take this half of it. Okay, let's start on the bottom. A little metal sticking out you want to clip that off okay you don't feel it poking it as long as it's not poking your face you're okay <laughs> okay let's get this eye in Trim this eye. Some more. Tear in half. I mean, you can use the whole piece of duct tape, but I don't think you want to do that. Okay. Here. Cut it here. Use this for this part. Fold this over. The reason is this is this this is protecting you from that um cable mesh right there, the little aluminum cable mesh. All right, the last piece goes here. Trim it off. Okay, there you have it. Trim it. There you have it. Filter, the extra filter for the mesh side. The metal mesh shot. Uh, alrighty. Next is got this on Amazon a while back. It's for um, protect your face from the sun. It's almost like a stretchy material, bandana type, where it slips over your head and kind of like a bandit style um, bandana but it's a stretchy kind but I notice if you
could go around the house or go buy yourself some stretchy pants will do the same so you just take one side of the pants leg on a stretchy pants and turn it inside out inside out okay look for the halfway point the halfway points here here's your face mask this is the outside this is your face side so your face side will be right here no face side will be right here let's see if you put this over when you're wearing it okay sorry guys it's gonna be reversed it's kind of tricky your face side the side that's touching your face with the extra padding of filter will be down okay have yourself some duct tape You could use hot glue, but you can't replace it. If you need to replace this, if you hot glue it, there's no way it will take it off. Okay. And use half so you don't waste duct tape. there now you want to flip this over like that turn it inside out there you have it you could even you could just leave this out open like that as long as the mask is right here. This is what's going to protect your face right here. So when I put it on, I'll show you. Okay, there you have it. A nice mask. And then if you don't need it, you just pull it down. And if you do need it, pull it back up. easy and affordable and stylish too all right guys all right guys there you have it nice mask if you happen to go out and try to look for one you can't find one make yourself one be safe and out of harm's way keep watching our map use. Thanks.